Hey everyone, Technomancer here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to enable the Google Assistant on your Android phone so you can say, hey Google, and interact with your phone. So let's get started. So you can do this in two different ways. You can do it from the settings directly from your settings app, and you might see an option that says Google Services right here, and you click All Services, and then you can go to Search Assistant and Voice, and you'll see this setting. Now, if you don't see this, this can also be reached from by going to the Google app itself and then tapping on that top corner and then going to settings, same exact setting. And right here, it's going to say Google Assistant. So we're going to tap on that. Now, once it does, you're going to see the very first option here that says voice match. We're going to tap on that. And right here, it says, hey, Google, we need to go ahead and turn that on. And in order to turn it on, we're going to go ahead and see this. We're going to hit agree. And then you need to teach Google to recognize your voice. So you're going to say, hey, Google. So you hear the check mark. So you're going to hit agree. And you're going to say these commands. Hey, Google, help me write a thank you note. Hey, Google, what's the weather tomorrow? Hey, Google, explain how rainbow is formed. Okay, Google, set a timer for five minutes. And okay, Google is now ready. After I set all those commands, I hit next here. And as you can see here, we can start saving audio to improve it. I'm just going to select nah. It doesn't matter. From there on, it is turned on and ready to use. So we can go ahead and interact with it. Hey, Google, how can you help me? And as you can see, it can interact with this. Now, keep in mind on the newer iPhone, newer Samsung phones, you also have the option to switch between the type of Google Voice Assistant that you're using versus uh, Gemini as well. So you'll be able to use both of the assistant in your newer iPhone, newer Samsung phone, just like that. So that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If so please consider hitting the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.